Hi guys, welcome to Betty's Cooking Channel. Today I'm gonna to make you some keto tacos. This is my recipe for keto tacos. So we're gonna start off with one pound ground turkey meat, 93% uh, lean, 7% fat. We have black pepper, rosemary, thyme leaves, paprika, onion powder, sea salt, garlic powder, chili powder, cumin, turmeric. The other items we have uh, is lettuce. We have one bowl, then we're gonna make two taco bowls and some sour cream. This is gonna be delicious. It's an easy recipe, but it's gonna be delicious. I'm gonna give you the amount that I will use in the recipe. And also that will be posted in the description box or, or on my website, which is bettyscookingchannel.com. So let me get started. I have added two teaspoons of oil. You could use avocado oil. You could use bacon grease. I've added all my seasoning. Let me go over that. Half a teaspoon of dry thyme. Half a teaspoon of dry rosemary. One teaspoon of cayenne pepper. Two teaspoons of chili powder. Three teaspoons of paprika powder. One teaspoon of onion powder. One and a half teaspoons of garlic powder one teaspoon of black pepper, half a teaspoon of turmeric, three tablespoons of cumin powder, and one and a half teaspoon of sea salt. Only thing I haven't put in the skillet is my cayenne pepper. So let me grab that right now. I thought I was videoing everything that I placed in the pan. Apparently, I wasn't. So let me, let me get the cayenne pepper. Smells so good in here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and add the cayenne pepper. If you don't like it spicy, don't add the cayenne pepper. But I like spicy foods. And like I said, this is uh, my recipe. You can tweak it make, it, make it your own, whatever you need to do. But it's a fantastic recipe. I'm gonna let it cook a little bit longer, and then I will, I will be ready to place it in a bowl. I have allowed the turkey meat to cool off a little bit. I don't like to add it to the bowl right away. I'm gonna opt not to add cheese to mine, but I'm gonna add the sour cream. It's up to you, you're gonna add the cheddar cheese. I'm just gonna add the lettuce. at the bottom of the bowl. And I'm gonna place my um, taco meat on the top. Oh. 
looks good and it smells delicious. And I'm gonna go ahead and add the sour cream to the top of this dish. This is about a heaping tablespoon. That's about all I need on mine. Mm. I love sour cream and yogurt. I usually have um, Greek yogurt, unsweetened Greek yogurt, and I add stevia and what it, whatever uh, strawberries or uh, blackberries I have, or either blueberries to the uh, mix. And I have that for breakfast. I enjoy that because I've always been one of those people that had yogurt in the morning and it always, I don't know, it just always kept the weight off of me when I used to eat yogurt. Over the years, I kind of changed from that, but I'm, I'm back to that um, because that's what my body needs. So I'm gonna show you the final product. I know some of you are gonna say, where is the cheddar cheese? Cheddar cheese is in the refrigerator. This is what I wanted on mine, just so you know. I will take a picture with one with cheddar cheese and one without it, just so you can see it. That's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful dish. Take one more with the cheddar cheese. Let me taste it. Just right for me. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy this recipe. Hey guys, I hope you like this video. I hope you subscribe comment and share this video with your friends and family. Thank you for watching.